Cody, when you were drafted and brought into Brooklyn, how much did you anticipate playing early on? Like I told you before, uh, I thought I'll spend most of the time in the G League, though. And then, I don't know, we just, you know, it changed, changed. Things changed, you know, and I just, I just, I just came to the first team, you know, and started to play a little bit, then more, and more, even more, because you know, guys, guys, guys got injured, and I mean, you know, before the season, I was expecting like to be in the G League most of the time, you know. So you really took advantage of your opportunity, and it looked like the adjustment was smooth. What was the biggest adjustment you had to make, though, to the NBA game? The NBA game, uh, I think all these travels, maybe, uh, and toughness. Uh, I like toughness though, but you know, I had to I had to play tougher here in Europe because uh, you know they don't they don't really you know call the fouls a lot here, so I had to play tougher, so be be stronger, and for sure it's pace of pace of the game also is different, you know, and I think I think I mean I like it. I didn't, it wasn't like big change for me, but I just like it, you know, and that's the biggest change for me here. It's a it's a long NBA season. A lot of veterans in that locker room. What's the a piece of advice one of the veterans has given you as far as getting through this season? Uh, take care of the body definitely because uh, they know that you know now they now uh, I'm playing more minutes. You know I have to take care of my body, be ready for the next game. You know, and uh, also after the tough loses, they, he, they say like just just move on because. The best thing in the NBA is to do we have game next day. So you just have to forget it and just play. Uh, you're the first 20 games that you started, you averaged about 11 points. You had a stretch of about 11 or so games where it was about six points where, where your production took a little bit of a dip. What were you experiencing at, during that time? I mean, it was, uh, I, played, I played a lot. So it was maybe a little bit harder for me because uh, before, like last season, I didn't play a lot of minutes, so maybe I think that was that was the problem. But then I got the rest and all star break, you know, and things things went up again. So yeah, you've given the team uh, you know a boost lately, and averaging yeah. about 13 in your last three. What's been the difference lately for you, and and what you've been able to provide the team at the power forward spot? I mean, it's good, you know, just playing my game, and uh, I'm just happy to help the team again. Uh, just doing my job, you know, like what coach want from me, you know, some rebounds and stuff like that, like bringing energy to the guys and the team. And again, in the starting lineup, so that, that feels good too. Last thing, what does it mean to you after again not playing that much overseas? What does it mean to you to be a part of a playoff run right now and in the mix and starting lineup regular rotation? The thing is that I've never been in playoffs, so for me, this season already means a lot because we're in a playoff spot, you know, we're fighting for playoffs. I've never been. I've never been in that situation, so it means a lot, you know. And uh, of course, of course, playing a lot, a lot of minutes here in the NBA, in the best league in the world, so it means a lot. It's an incredible experience for me.